Hey guys, what's up? My name is Sean Rusalt and welcome to my Duffer programming series. In this video we're going to be learning how to receive input via an input box function. So I just created my GUI, so let's quickly create the GUI. Um, input with the input box function. Let's name the form FOM home. Um, position center. Let's save it. Um, piece. Okay, this is the seventeenth video. Um, input with the input box function. Okay, let's name this. U. Oh scheiße. What? Oh. Let's name this U. Um. Home, I guess. Okay. Um. Input with the input box function. That should be capital I. Okay. Let's add a normal. Oh, what in my property? Oops. To add a normal button to the form. Um, basically, what we're going to be making now is a simple email input um, thingy. <laughs> yeah. Okay, um, um, input email, let's add a bit button with the same um, height and width and left. Let's change the font size to 12 or maybe 14, 16, 16 is fine. Okay, let's add a kind to the bit button. We we'll add a okay one. Okay, let's add a label to the form. We'll align it to the bottom. Alignment will be center and um, email goes. Okay. Set the font to 20 or 16. We'll leave it 16. How do I see when it's in the middle? That looks about the middle. Yeah, okay. Okay. God, go on like. Let's do this. Let's, uh, go to the. What to? Uh, okay. Anyway, sorry guys. Um, let's write some code. Variable. Add a, let's add a variable. We call it email. Sort of type string. So how does the input box function work? It said email silent operator to the input box that's basically how it looks okay so the first thing that it, that it wants is basically a caption for the input box let me first show, show, show you how the input box actually looks so as you guys can see here um, Let's, let's, let's add it like that. Let's add a one, two, and a three. So it has three um, values in the parentheses. It's basically the captions value one, two, and three. That's basically 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 the best way to explain it. So let's add the um, next email. Enter your email. And we'll leave free empty. 
let's make this email a global variable and not a um, local one let's add it here okay the ok button will just let's just rename this label let's name it LBL output the ok button will now set this equals to the caption to the email that's basically it uh, I trouble getting the output file and why is that? anyway it's my email I'm not going to type my email here or should I? No, I'm not going to ask I could add gmail.com okay you press on OK and yeah, it, is, it just it displays the email for us it's basically how to receive input VI and input box instead of an edit, an edit or something else that is it for this video guys um, thanks for watching please make sure to like, comment, subscribe and share and I'll see you in the next video which will probably be um, in a few minutes yeah it's currently 3am in the morning and I'm making videos again so yeah Bye. Bye.